deliveries, an incredibly important daily chore that often can be confusing and difficult to deal with. If you don't have good supervision over your deliveries, you'll quickly lose control over your inventory. Our new delivery system makes this daily task simple and efficient. Let's take a look. We'll click on delivery routing and we can see with a quick glance here that we've got a couple of invoices scheduled for today, the 17th, and a couple of more for tomorrow also shows you the number of items to be delivered. If we click invoice list, we see the customer's name and the quantity. And if we click on the invoice itself, we see all the detail for that stop. We're going to go here for the deliveries for today, the 17th. And now we want to search and see if we have anything else that we can add to today's deliveries. We can search by a variety of different methods, by customer name, city, zip code. We can even assign our deliveries to specific trucks and zones. I'm going to simply click search, and here's a couple more stops that we can add. If I double click here on the left side, any of the items scheduled for delivery will automatically be added to the route. Now I'm going to click here. If I double click on just a single item, only that item will be added to the route. Now, if we take a quick look here, you'll see we have some bedroom furniture. But this sale, you can use Control I to quickly access it. We sold more items on this sale. We have the bedroom set, which is in stock, ready to be delivered. We sold a clock there at the bottom. That's already been taken. And we have some upholstery, which has been placed on a PO, but has not yet been received. Let's go back to look at our delivery, and you'll see it only contains the items that are available to be scheduled right now. It's a very smart system. So I'll click here, add all the items to our stock, We'll drag this down so we can see everything. And you'll notice here, today we're only doing deliveries for our Midtown zone. If we go to take a look at tomorrow, all those delivery schedules so far are for a zone we call South Bay. Let's go back to today. And we'll show you some of the reports that we can run. First of all, we'll double click on the pick list. And the pick list shows you all the items that need to be pulled for the day's deliveries. We have a delivery manifest. This shows you each stop, customer's name and address. We also have a manifest with detail. The difference is here, in addition to the customer's information, you also have the information of all the items that are scheduled to be delivered. If we go here and click on Google Maps, we get a map view of all the daily stops. After taking a look at the map, you may want to resort the deliveries. Simply click sort and you can move each stop up or down as far as the order for the day's deliveries. The delivery manifest showed you the stop number. When it's time to load the truck, you'll find delivery labels very handy. They contain all the same information as the delivery manifest, but this way you can affix a label to each item that is scheduled to be delivered and efficiently load the truck. The idea being the items with the highest stop numbers are the items you load first in the back of the truck. Doing your day's deliveries with the merchandise properly loaded makes things much simpler. Most Furniture Wizard customers have been using a copy of the invoice as the delivery document. That's not very efficient. 
In our example from before, you could have an invoice where some items are already taken, some items are back ordered, and you only have a few items to deliver today. This way, only those items are being displayed on the delivery slip, and you can print all the day's deliveries or all of a specific truck's deliveries at once. You'll see the delivery slips contain the information same as the manifest, plus we've added the amount of COD to collect for each stop, and you have the disclaimer so your customer can properly sign off on the delivery. The last step is to post your deliveries, and that's very simple. You simply do check all and post if everything has been delivered, but as we all know, Every once in a while, an item is reviewed. So if we edit it, once we do that, you'll see we've updated the color of that item to make it easy to keep track of which items you have performed the edit on. Now we'll click Post. All of those items have been deducted from inventory. You do not need to go and update each item in each invoice individually. As you can see with the new delivery system, what was previously a time-consuming task is now very quick, very easy to do, and far more efficient.